Sarah and Harry, we have come here to give you our blessing for a wonderful future together. May you love deeply, laugh heartedly, practice patience and smile often. Dream together, grow together, be a little crazy, give, give in and trust enough to take. Share many sunrises, listen to the rain, savour special moments. Above all else, let this day be a reminder of your love and of the promises you have made to share your lives in marriage. Um, I think that it's an extraordinary thing to bear witness to your best friend, your sister, falling in love with her soulmate. And I feel incredibly blessed to have seen Sarah and Harry's love grow as they've grown and all the ways they've contributed to the people they are just by being absolutely astounding, amazing people. It's always going to be a good time if Harry's around. He's, he's just so caring and so beautiful and he always puts others before himself. And he's mine. <laughs> I get to keep him now. <laughs> I sort of uh, always knew deep down that, uh, that Sarah was the one. All of a sudden, everything started coming, you know, perfectly into alignment. And, you know, now is the right time to, to propose. Um, and, um, yeah, I thought it was pretty obvious that it was coming, but she had no idea. He's like, right, pack your bag. You need to make sure you can wear something that if it's windy, you're going to be OK. You know, I was sort of pushing her to do her makeup and wear a nice dress. and. I've organised something, it's nothing. Like, don't get your hopes up about anything. It's... She thought we were going on a gondola ride and, yeah, you know, when we rocked up, she realised pretty quickly that um, something a little bit bigger. We sat up at the front of the boat, there's bean bags, there's sakar tars, there's camembert, and then the wind picks up a bit and old mate Skipper comes out the front and says, oh, I think we need to put the other sail on. Like, we, the, the wind's changed and I thought, yeah, that sounds like something that you do. <laughs> and anyway, Harry's helping him hook up this sail. I'm into the sidecar tars. <laughs> and then he's pulling the sail up. And then in these massive letters, it says, will you marry me? Sort of surprise on her face was the best thing on earth to see. I still get goosebumps that that's how he actually did it. And it was such a surprise because I had no idea at all. And it just, oh, it's amazing. It was just amazing. <laughs> First and foremost, uh, I am the happiest man alive and I can't believe I get to call Sarah Mrs. Kinnett. Oh. <laughs> um, my darling Sarah, you are so incredibly fierce and strong and ambitious and clever and breathtakingly beautiful. And it's an unbelievable honour to be your best friend and also to be here celebrating your union to this gorgeous man. I can't imagine a couple more ready or more right for this blessing. And I couldn't have ever imagined a bride more perfect for Harry. Thank you, Sarah, for bringing so much joy to all of us. Today, they face the future. United in their love, Sarah and Harry, you have experienced true love. True love is timeless, giving and growing. You have come here today as two individuals. May you always long to be together and walk together as one.